Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back to my episode 2 of Iron Man on- what? If you guys are new to Dreamscape, you'll be greeted with a message in the chat down below asking where you found the server. Make sure to select YouTuber and then type my name, Eggy, in the chat for a free tack through box. I hope you guys enjoyed the video and let's get into it. Also guys, real quick, the first comment on the video is one of themselves a super mystery box. And just like always, if you guys want a better chance of winning the first comment prize on every video, make sure to enable post notifications by hitting the bell down below. And moving on, as you can see, this is massive. Two random commenters down below are each going to win themselves 50 million DS coins. I know it's only like my fifth video on Dreamscape, but this is the biggest DS giveaway I've ever done. To enter guys, just like always, all you have to do is like the video, comment your in-game name down below, subscribe to my channel, and make sure to enable post notifications because on every video, the first commenter gets a prize. Also guys, be sure to join my Discord by using the link down below, as that is where I post every video's giveaway winners. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and let's get into it. Alright guys, I've literally just woken up, but I want to grab myself a daily task today. So I guess we're going to start off with an easy, and I have to complete one of the tasks in return and then I'll earn a reward. So the Pikachus aren't necessarily beneficial towards me, but the Penguins are because I'm still only 70 prayer. So I'm going to go kill 100 Penguins real quick and I'll see you guys in a couple minutes. And completing my first task, 5 achievement points, 500 DS coins, and let's go see what I get. Come on, spin to win, come on. Bro, that's unlucky. Anyways, let's see what I get for an intermediate. So, kill 250 Crash Bandicoot. These really don't drop anything special, so I'm gonna quickly bang this out and hopefully I'll see you guys in a couple minutes. Oh, nice. Like 125 in, I just got myself a clue scroll. So, I'm gonna go do this real quick. Also, if you guys don't know, you can type in colon colon wiki clue scrolls and it'll open up the clue scroll page. 100 Phoenix Bones. Okay, normally I would complain, but I'm actually currently trying to level up my prayer, so that's fucking sick. Well, before I go do anything, I'm gonna go use all these bones up and see what level I end up at. And level 85. Hey, like 10 more, I got another clue scroll. And yes, I'm not bothering picking up the crystal keys, and I'm lazy as fuck. I seriously need that collector's necklace. And that's kind of shit. Got a royal sickle from that clue. And my Crash Bandicoot task is complete now. Another 1k DS coins, but more importantly, let's go back over to the Daily Master, and boom. We get a spin on a way better drop table. Dude, I am praying. Please give me the Pernix or the Death Cape. Yo, I just got Elite Pernix Chaps. That's actually pretty sick. Another decent little upgrade there. The hard task is 250 Necromancer. I am going to take a break from that because if you guys remember on episode one, I really want to actually work on prestiging my Slayer. So grabbing another task, what do we get? Steroid Penguin. I'm actually pretty happy with that. Yo, that is so good. I just got a golden katana from the penguin. Not necessarily better than my M4, but still a nice drop to have. Man, Slayer is so slow. If anybody can let me know down below anything I can do to speed this up, please. Next is going to be 44 Charmander. This is actually a super quick task. Wait, no way. I just got a double XP ring. I was opening up a few mystery boxes from drops and holy shit. I was literally just complaining about XP being slow. Also, I have four infinity keys from doing my dailies, so real quick just opening up these. An Inga sword, as well with an elite Virtus mask. That's gonna be sweet when I move over to mage. Anyways, in the meantime, back over to Slayer training, but now that I have my double XP ring, this should help out a little bit. Yo, that's sick. I just realized I can grab a Slayer task anywhere I want because I have the tier 1 donator rank. Next task is going to be 35 mini titan. Honestly hate this task so much. 75 Slayer, what's the next task? Vedion. Alright, that's easy enough. And what's next? Mini barrel chest. Bro, I'm skipping that. Luigi. That's a bit better. 38 Flame King. That's gonna be something different, finally. The Flame Torva is probably not that good for me, but I am finally moving over to the bosses, so my XP is going to be so much better from these. Level 79 from that task, not bad. Moving on guys, let's see what we grab. Flame Pernix. Alright, moving up in the world a bit. These are such better XP than fucking Pikachus and shit. I do actually kind of like Dreamscape's progression system with their Slayer Master. The way that it automatically gives you the task which is best for you, it's actually a really cool system. Hey, just got Flame Gloves, dude. Rare drop number one. And that's actually a huge upgrade as well. And last one of the task. Grabbing myself another Slayer task, let's see what we get today. Flame King. Once again, really good XP. I'm currently at 81 Slayer. Eventually, or sometime in this episode, I would actually like to kill those Necromancers and get that intermediate task done. As well, I would love to get to 92 Prayer so I can actually start killing the Revenants efficiently in the wild. Because the Collector's Necklace is fucking amazing and extremely detrimental to my account. Anyways, I'll see you guys after a few more Flame King. Also guys, real quick, I just noticed that I got myself a level 1 box. So I'm gonna open up that and get a Flame Torva Helm. Alright, fair enough. Another one done. What do we got next? KBD. Alright. 
currently 83 Slayer. I'm gonna take a little bit of a break from Slayer. I really wanna complete that intermediate task before the day actually ends. So jumping over to the Necromancer, hopefully we can actually get a lucky drop. This thing drops quite a few things. This thing drops the full Infernal set, which looks clean, and three of the best amulets in the game. This is an intermediate task, and like I said, I have 250 to kill. So this is gonna take quite a bit of time. Update, this is taking forever. I'm literally 150 in, and I haven't gotten a single fucking drop. This better be worth it, bro. Oh my god, that felt like forever. Holy shit. Please make this be worth my time. 1,500 DS coins from that. And it looks like there's some pretty sweet stuff in here as well. I can get Kion's staff, which would be amazing. Ice offhand, ascension crossbows. Come on, wish me luck. Hey, that's actually pretty good. I got the ascension crossbow. I'm probably not going to be able to do it, but let's see what the expert is. Diablos, Hades, or Lava Logs. That's going to be a pass from me for now. In the meantime, I would really like to get myself at least 92 prayer. So I guess back to the penguins for a little bit of a grind. And there we are. Finally getting level 92 prayer. That is honestly huge because now I've unlocked soul split. Honestly, that took way too much fucking time. Over 250 steroid and over 500 normal penguins. Unlucky. Either way, finally unlocking soul split. That is honestly huge for me. And now I can make this grind so much simpler. So wish me luck. I'm actually really hoping I get really lucky on this. Update, I have 364 kill count and 100 points. This is not going well. Yeah, at about 500 kill count, I'm actually looking pretty dry at the moment. So I'm gonna take a little bit of a break. I'm also not really sure the chance to upgrade this nocturnal chain. I failed. Again? Unlucky, I just failed all four of those. Anyways, we have seven more infinity keys, so you guys know what that means. What do we got? Come on! Elite Pernix body, that's actually sick. Couple more brutal whips and another golden chain. That Elite Pernix is amazing though, sweet. I seriously mean it. I'm honestly having so much fucking fun on this Iron Man. It is honestly mad fun. If you guys want to come check out Dreamscape, of course, links down below, just like always. Dreamscape is currently the number one custom RSPS and has been for about five years. Just like always, guys, there is a huge giveaway. Make sure to enter. All my links are down below. I hope you guys enjoyed, and later.